Get psyched, it's floor two. I uh, really like this floor. I like the blue ceiling specifically. There's a secret right here. Um, it's got ammunition. Oh, oh great. I just woke up like the entire floor, didn't I? Oh, that's fantastic. So yeah, I have fond memories of this floor. It's very large. Um, I mean, it's not the most complicated of the levels, but uh, it's, it's enjoyable, I think. Uh, you can see that, uh, look, the outside's right there. I should just leave this place. But no, we're on a mission. We gotta go kill, uh, what's his name? Um, Otto Griftmacher? Um, oh, what the hell's in here? Oh, wow, look at all these officers. Alright, so there's the exit. I'm picking up all this ammo and I don't need it. Well, it's okay, because there's a secret over here. With more ammunition and a machine gun. I'll just kind of save that, I guess. If you're at full ammo, yes, you can pick up machine guns. I'm pretty sure that I've uh, said that before. Probably. Who knows? I can't remember what I had for breakfast, much less what I've said in previous episodes. <laughs> in fact, I had... Uh, what did I have for breakfast? God, now I can't remember. What was it? Oh, yeah! That's right. Banana nut muffins. <laughs> These SS, they're banana nuts. Yeah. Stupid SS. And your blue uniforms. But you really like this floor, huh? Because of all the blue. Alright, so you might notice that, yes, that's the same area with the elevator. So if I wouldn't have killed the officers, I could just leave this floor right now. But that wouldn't be fun, now would it? No. No, it wouldn't. Oh, hey guys. Um, I wasn't really expecting you around that corner. But fair enough. Fair enough. It's over here. This room is empty, sort of. But look at that. Look at all that treasure. Look at all those one-ups. There's four one-ups. Oh man, all those crowns? So many points. How do you get in there? Well, you know, interesting story. When I was a kid, I could not, for the life of me, figure out how to get to that room. Oh no, I couldn't. I spent hours. I spent hours trying to figure it out. And then, one day, once I found a, you know, a map editor, oh man, I figured it out. And I was like, it's so obvious, but not really obvious at all. Let's kill all these guys. This is everything that I alerted previously. There's some stuff back here that we need. Um, but I do want to make sure that everything's dead. Yes, everything's dead. Good. Everything's dead. What's over here? A bunch of SS. Hey guys, how's it going? Oh man, I can already tell things are starting to get a little bit more difficult. Hey, it's a gold key. Sweet. What's in here? A med kit. I could use a med kit. Gotta deal with these guys. Alright, there's a secret somewhere over here. Why am I? Let me see. Is it over here? No, I must be on the wrong side of the level. It's over here, isn't it? Yeah, there it is. Okay. Alright, so the secrets on this level are actually pretty interesting. So, you can't push that wall. We can push this one. Alright, that's good. And we can push this one. This comes over this way. And look at this treasure! That's nice. Um, I'm not gonna go through those doors yet. I'm gonna, come, I'm gonna come back to that because I want to explain something. You see, I guess when Wolfenstein came out, um, you know, nowadays when you download a game and uh, there's like bugs in the code or something, you can just download a patch. They'll just push a patch out and there you go. Now, back in the days of, you know, Wolfenstein, you couldn't really do that because the internet really wasn't a thing at the time, so... There are a couple different versions of this game. Let's kill that officer because he's a bitch. Oh, wow, look at all these... Look at all these guards. Come on, come through these doors. I'm gonna stab the next guy who comes through here. Oh, oh shit. <laughs> okay, I will not stab you. I'll stab you once and then back off. Oh, man, so many guards. Anyways, there's a bunch of different versions. And, um, depending on which version you had, the secret areas, or the push walls, I should say, acted differently. Sometimes they would only go two squares, sometimes they'd go three squares. Well, I'm pretty sure as a kid, when I had this game, I had an older version because the push walls would go three tiles instead of two. And, um, well, you can block off a bunch of secrets depending on which version you're using. So, for example, there's a secret right here. It's filled with treasure. 
All right, that's that's great. That's fantastic. This is a, this is a push wall right here. If I push it on this version of the source code, I block a bunch of secrets off, and that's not good. No, it's not. Now, if I was on a um, different version of the source code, then uh, I could, you know, it'd, it'd go the three tiles and it wouldn't be a big deal at all. Why am I talking about this? I don't know. It's somewhat interesting, I guess, at least to me. I have a degree in computer science, so those kind of weird code issues are, I guess, interesting to me. Holy shit! That's a lot of SS! Oh man! Let's kill these bastards. Alright, I think they're all deaf, so... I think there's like six of them in here. Yep, there's more. That's what I figured. Ah, okay, it's clear. Alright, so... There's a secret right here? Yes? And as you can see, that's the same wall that I was just talking about. So you could get to this room two different ways, depending, or if you're using a, you know, an older version of the source code. So I'm gonna go ahead and push that wall, and uh, now here we go. Here's the fun. There's a nice little push wall maze. So you wanna push that wall, and then you wanna push this wall, and now you have a choice. You can hit the one on the left, or you can hit the one on the right. If you hit this one, you fucked up. So you wanna hit this one? I should have saved. I really hope this is right. I'm gonna save, just to be safe. Alright, so if... Yeah, there's another two choices. You can hit the one in the middle, or you can hit this one. Don't, don't, don't hit the one in the middle. That's bad. No, don't do that. Um, Alright, if I push this one right here, I block off a bunch of treasure. It was that room with the four one-ups. Yeah. So push that wall right there. Push this wall, and there you go. We just got a shit ton of treasure. All right, and four one-ups, and a chain gun, and just everything possible. I just got it. Okay. But what I really want to do is I still want to get all the secrets. Now, you could block yourself out right now, and that would kind of suck. So, I did get everything in here right. I just want to double check. It's empty? It's empty. Okay, good. So we're gonna go ahead and push this wall block off that door, because I want 100% of the secrets. Yes, I do. And I don't think I'm going to need the one-ups. Do you think I'm going to need the one-ups? Or the, the one-ups. The medkits? No. I'm not going to need the medkits. So I'm going to push that wall. And then there's another wall to push right here, and there you go. Now I know that explanation is probably pretty confusing, and you're probably asking yourself, what the, f what the fuck are you talking about? Well, um... If you look at a map, it makes much more sense. So, there you go. And I think that's the level. I think we can just get the hell out of here. I think. Did I get everything? No, I didn't get everything. I missed some secrets. There's secrets in here. This just has a med kit, doesn't it? Yeah. And then over here is another room. Yes. Another room. Interesting. Oh, look at the treasure! Oh no, there's officers! Not that I'm really worried about two officers, but, you know. Uh, maybe. Maybe they're super dangerous. I feel like I screwed something up, though. That's kind of how I feel when I play this level. Like, I screwed something up. That's just pretty much how episode 4 goes. Did I clear all this out? Yes, I did. Okay, I think I got everything. I'm gonna go, I guess, hit the elevator and see. Um, let me look at the map. Did I get... Okay, I did that, I did that, I did that. Yeah, it looks good to me. It looks good to me. Let's come over here. Is there anything in here? Nope. It's empty. Just like I expected it to be. <clears throat> Let's see. Oh, I missed it. I missed the kill somewhere. I go. I gotta go hunt down one Nazi. I have no idea where he's at. Oh man, that's gonna that's gonna suck. Oh yeah, you think you're gonna get away from me, Nazi? No, 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 no. That's not how this works. You obviously have not been paying attention. Alright, let's go find this son of a bitch. Is he in here? No, he's not. I don't see him in here. I don't see him at all. Where? What did I miss? Where is he? I hate this kind of stuff. Where you miss one guard. I have literally no idea where he's at. Alright, he's over. not over here. I cleared this out. He's not over here. Is there a deaf guard or something that I missed? Maybe that's it. I'm assuming it's somebody who's patrolling, that's my guess. But, 
Don't take my word for that, because I'm just not sure. I'm not sure where he's at. Or what he's doing, or... Oh, hey, there he is. How's it going, buddy? I missed this room. Okay. Yeah, it just had some food and ammunition in it. Don't need it. Don't care. Alright, now let's get the hell out of here. Yeah, I'm not letting any of these Nazis get away. No. No, they deserve everything that's coming to them. Okay. There we go. Now I got everything. Only took me ten minutes. Oh, man. Compared to episode three, this is... God, this is like four episodes if I was doing episode three. Or four videos. Anyways, I was Arduous. Thanks for watching. Next time, Floor 3, thanks for watching.